I feel really good about this, like it's gonna be good. Never had it. I didn't even know that St. Mary's had so many different flavors. But I feel good, good, good about this. It's Yasmin Abdallahad from the Jamaican Experience with Yaz, where I bring you a Jamaican experience that transcends sand, sea, and sensimilia. If you're living in Jamaica, particularly if you are a parent or anyone who has an interest in buying brand Jamaica, this video is for you. In this video, I'm doing a snack haul for products of Jamaica. So stay tuned for prices, choices, and top picks. Thank you for clicking on this video. If you're new here, welcome. This channel is about all things Jamaican. And if you like the video, leave us a thumbs up and subscribe for more great content like this. Also, you can follow me on Instagram at Yazel. So why did I decide to do a brand Jamaica snack haul? Well, as a parent, I buy snacks for my children uh, pretty much on a weekly basis. I myself don't snack a lot, but I do snack a little. <laughs> and so I want to be supporting our Jamaican businesses, especially at a time like this with COVID-19 and business are, businesses are suffering. I definitely want to be prioritizing supporting our Jamaican brands. Of course, I still buy snacks from other places. Um, we've gotten used to, you know, many other brands that are imported from other countries, but I really want to give our Jamaican businesses, you know, the support that they deserve. And of course, lots of times we think that we're buying brand Jamaica and we're not. Many, um, there are businesses here that will distribute products from other companies. It's not manufactured here, it's manufactured in another country. No, of course, there's nothing wrong with buying those products because we're still supporting a, a Jamaican business, the distributor. But I really think that we need to try and support our Jamaican manufacturers as well. So what did I find? I have a whole bunch of goodies here. See, yeah, all, all made in Jamaica or, or distributed by a Jamaican company. So first up, we have the JP St. Mary's brand, this one. And everyone is pretty much familiar with this brand. Um, this has been around for uh, for quite some time. You know, we've been snacking on this for a long time. This is the kind of snack that you find when you're in traffic and you're well hungry. Just about every vendor has one of these. Now, this is the original. I think this is the original. This is what I remember being the original. Very good, salty. I don't need to taste this for you on camera because if you haven't had it, listen, you need to go and get it now because this this been around way too long for you to not have tried it. If you're not from Jamaica, um, you should try this when you get here. I didn't know that they had an extra crunch one. No, and I, I can't believe I didn't know that. You know, so this is a new one. I haven't tried this one. So I think I should try it, right? Try it. All right, let's try it. If I tell you the truth, to be honest, I don't taste any difference in the crunch aspect of it, but it's still very good, salty and nice. It's great. So I don't taste any difference in the crunch, but extra crunch, I'm assuming they did as something a little extra. So maybe you can choose, you can pick this up or pick up both of them just to see. Next we have the plantain and um have you ever had any plantain chips before i'm sure it's pretty much the same but let's do this <gasps> let's do this real quick <laughs> mm -hmm. and this is the green plantain very nice tastes like plantain chips love it it's not too salt too that's one thing i like about their brand it's not too oily and it's not too salt. And this is cassava. All right, I've never had this, so let's do it. 
never ever had cassava. Mmm! What? Mmm! This is really good. And it's sour cream. Um, even if you don't like sour cream, please give this a try. This is really good. Mmm! -mm. Wow! Mmm! Tasty. Next up, we have bread food. And it says lightly salted. I don't know if they have another option with a little bit more salt. Because, you know, some of us like our snacks salty. I don't mind lightly salted. And bread food is all over Jamaica. So it's about time somebody makes a, made a, 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 a bread food chips. You know what I mean? Well, let's try it. I like it, but... I know, tell you no lie. You know when you roast that breadfruit and you salt it and you slice it thinly and you just place it in that nice hot oil? I gotta say, I prefer that to this, but this is great. If you want, if you have, if you want a breadfruit fix, if breadfruit is out of season. And you want a breadfruit fix, or if it's in season, and you know if you don't have any or you can't make none, honestly, this is great. It's not oily, which is also a plus for me. What else do we have? From St. Mary's, we also have this potato chips. And I'm gonna try this because I'm assuming potato chips, they all pretty much taste the same, pretty much. But this one. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, I just noticed something. This says gluten, gluten free right here and if you can see that gluten free and also no cholesterol zero trans fat and according to the doctors the trans fat is the bad one so there's nothing wrong with fat but the trans fat that's the bad one so, so this is good Whoa. so i'm gonna try this real quick no there is a brand that we all know with a yellow bag. I'm not going to call the name. It's not from Jamaica. People all over the world love it. And when you open it, nothing not in the bag. To be honest, I'm going to have too much in this bag too. <laughs> but um, it's not as oily as that brand. And it still tastes good. And this is the spicy one. Same gluten-free, no cholesterol, no trans fat. So I'm going to try this because I love spice. And I love a spicy snack, especially in a chicken sandwich. Ooh, yeah. Mm -mm. Whoa. Mm -mm. Boy, I don't know if this is scotch bonnet or pepper sauce. <laughs> Whatever it is, it is, it has a wicked kick to it. And I like it. So, all right, all right, and, and St. Mary's also has a cassava chips, another, so there's another cassava chips here, this one is lightly salted, not sour cream, so if you don't like sour cream, hey, there is an option. Next up, I have the national brand, because I've put them in brands, because it's easier, and um, this is a zesty white cheddar popcorn. And notice it says an, an original Jamaican product. Now, what I've noticed is that most of the products that are actually manufactured in Jamaica will say something like products of Jamaica or made in Jamaica or an original Jamaican product. So the things, the ones that don't say it, usually they are um, distributed by a Jamaican brand, Jamaican company, but not necessarily manufactured here. That's one thing I've observed. Um, because National will have several products that they distribute for other brands overseas. But they don't, so for the ones that they manufacture here, they do add, they try to distinguish it by putting um, an original Jamaican product or product of Jamaica, something like that. So this is the Zesty White Cheddar Popcorn. Um, to be honest, I'm not going to taste this on here today. I think my mouth has... Let me have some water. Can I get rid of that taste from the chips so I can give an honest review? Um, so they have this one here. If you like popcorn, give it a try. Um, then we have this. 
This is original, original. If you grew up in Jamaica, you can grow up in Jamaica and haven't had this. All right, so this one here is baked in Jamaica. So it is an original Jamaican product. Let me tell you something. Just about every elementary school here, prep and prep school as well as uh, public has these snacks. Some kind of outside vendor, some kind of talk shop or something has these. These are, you know, this uh, Jamaican school. <laughs> so these are great. I had to pick them up. This one, you know, there's no snack haul, snack video without crackers because crackers and cheese, crackers and jam, crackers and something. <laughs> so let's try this one. Let's see. Mm, so this is sour cream and onion. This is the only one I saw at the time. I don't know if they have other flavors like plain. Generally for me, I prefer my snacks to be plain because when they're plain, you can do more with it. You know, nothing interfering with the flavor of what you're adding to it. This is not anything to rave about for me. But it's all right. So give it a try. Maybe you'll like it. The sour cream flavor is not strong. It's not potent. But um, it's just not the best cracker for me and but this is also 100% made in Jamaica and this now is their popcorn sweet and salty I said it before that I'm not a huge popcorn fan but I'm gonna try this one it's sweet and salty so let's try it again I really need to have the, the children review this one because for me, I'm just not a huge fan of popcorn, so I guess it's not fair for me to, to even say. But this is an option if your kid likes popcorn, or if you like popcorn, sweet and salty. It's not bad at all, it's just that I'm not a huge um, sweet fan. Yeah, the only thing I like sweet is chocolate, pretty much. And then we have this Jack Snaps. What is he? <laughs> coconut and here we go another original product of Jamaica another option for your children and then we have the oatmeal I love these these are awesome I love to buy them for my kids as well I feel like they're a, they're a healthier option snack and they like it too not too much but they like it <laughs> all right so what else do I have I have another cracker here and this is from the purity brand no I've heard all kinds of things said about this, but I'm gonna tell you, I'm here to defend this cracker. I love this cracker and I, even though I've had it before, I really wanted to include it in the video. And if you haven't had it, try it. It, it does say whole wheat, they have other options as well. Um, but this, um, let, let me tell you, if I'm on a diet, this is still on my grocery list, regardless of what I'm doing. I love this snack. Then we have, this is another chips again. Everybody know this. It's, the brand is Nicey's. Nicey's, um, what do you think about this? Um, this is another famous popular one with school kids. Um, what do you think about this? Nicey's, let me know. Let me know in the comments what you think about this one. Now I have some things from the Honey Bun brand. This is like a, this one is like a Twinkie. This is also a product of Jamaica. See that little thing there? Yeah. So this is like a Twinkie. You want to know, I think I've had this before. It's a cakey, it has a little cream inside, like I said, like a Twinkie. And it's good. I like it. So, give it a shot. This one is a cinnamon roll and the funny thing is i'm not a huge cinnamon roll person but i'm gonna try this because i've never had it before um and i want to see if it's different if i like it mm. i like this this is good worth it mm. the cinnamon flavor to be honest is not very strong but you know that's generally the case with these packaged goods you can't you don't always get too much you know these commercial goods it's not like you're baking it at home but I like it. I like it. It could be nice with some cheese and things. And this here is Bulla. <laughs> no, I don't know what the history is behind Bulla, but Bulla is something that's been around for a long time. It's very, very important to our, our, to our culture. 
to our food, to our diet, in terms of, you know, this is road food. If you're hungry, all right, let's not say it's road food. But if you don't have a lot of money and you're on the road, Bullock will definitely stop a gap. If you're a working person, you know, especially physical labor and you need little energy and all kind of things. And this is from the Regal brand, Regal Bakery in Montego Bay. I'm going to taste it because it's been years since I've tasted Bula. <laughs> years. Okay, obviously I couldn't have covered all the brands in this video. However, if you own a Jamaican brand, uh, if you manufacture snacks here in Jamaica or distribute snacks here in Jamaica, or uh, if you know of snacks, Jamaican brand snacks that are tasty, type the name of your brand in the comments below. If you like this video and you want to see more content like this, type yes in the comments below. Also, if you like this video, remember to share and subscribe for more great content like this. We upload videos every week, so tap that notification bell and you'll never miss a video when we upload. Thank you for watching and remember, Jamaica is not just a place, it's an experience.